So we just parked up here with uh, Marco and Tina and Sean from Project Camper. And we've just come back from having our new shoes fitted to the van. Uh, I've had my BF Goodrich tires on for three years now. And um, although they were still legal, um, the tread had gone down quite a bit. So I decided, because obviously the Scottish winter and all that sort of stuff to get some new tires, massive difference with grip already. So uh, I trust them, I've had no issues over the past couple of years. So yeah, we're just, we've got some new shoes today. Really cool, really happy. This is our park up for tonight, south of Inverness. And I think tomorrow, hopefully, uh, head towards Aviemore. It's gonna be another cold, snowy evening they reckon on the weather report so we're all just off for a, a nice long walk go stretch our legs and give Archie a little bit of a run out see you in a bit but it's the old one so the quality will be really bad every time I meet you it's like the battery's not charged <laughs> the SD card's full of course shit got real we are the cardic <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so bad prepared every time. <laughs> it's just because we check everything when we go outside, you know. Is the GoPro charged? Yes. Sean, Sh Sean the, sh uh, the sheep. That's yes. it. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> yeah, no. mm. I thought of course they had a well, the kind of rock they had a little bit. At least find something. Yeah. Then. Ah, down my neck! <laughs> Natural film effects. Yeah. <laughs> Lisa, come on here. There must have more work on. Back on. Hey, it's unglaublich, oder dieser Schnee? Ich glaube voll abgehen. Der würde sogar ums Bein ziehen.
people can you get in a van? A lot more, I think. Yeah. Six, six people? We've got Sean, Marco, the, the wife, <laughs> everyone's wife. <laughs> so. The housewife. I want milk, but I, I milk? put... Yeah, please. But how, how much? That's the question. That's the very important question. I'm not with any milk. Because it's... Like this or more? That's fine. Thank you. And you? Same. No pressure. Look we've, how even it is. We've missed you. <laughs> I missed you too. I missed you. Somebody did miss you. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll stop recording now. Chewbacca! Try and go inside. It's snowing again. So Tina and Marco left to go back to Inverness quickly to have a brake check done and to go shopping at the big Tesco's. And me and Sean are still here. Then, uh, I said, yeah, like, Rob's in front, he's giving him some space because we don't know what happens. Good morning, it's snowing again. So, uh, we had a lovely night here. Beautiful little spot. And uh, we are all heading to Abbeymore today, hopefully to find some more snow. That's the long-term plan, so me and Archie are just going to have a little walk. Yeah, look at this. And then head to Avonmore in an hour's time or so. So we'll see you in Avonmore. <laughs> Stay there. <laughs> Just watch for a bit, mate, to see if they get it out. Another good reason I'm glad I got my tyres done yesterday. I was just about to say that. Forward thinking. <clears throat> Prior planning and preparation, young man. First law of van life. Don't go unprepared. Absolutely epic, like we've come from our park up onto the A9 heading towards Avonmore and so many trucks, cars are stuck, it's, uh, it's pretty epic. I'm doing five mile an hour. It's a good job I had new, the, bat, the boot van had new shoes yesterday, all shaky. Got myself some new BF Goodrich tyres yesterday and they are working a treat.
Good morning from the Cairngorms, from Glenmore Forest. We are, so yesterday we arrived with uh, Sean from Project Camper and from Tina and Marco, uh, my German friend. We, uh, unfortunately, the uh, top road was closed um, and we don't understand why, uh, but there was a lot of mountain rescue police and all that sort of stuff, so probably a uh, incident, so totally understand why the road was closed. So we parked down here where we normally park sometimes, uh, but the road is open, so since six o'clock this morning, it's been like the M25, a car is getting up, and there is no clouds, the sun is out, the, you can see the mountains clearly, so it is now, uh, 9.38 in the morning we are about to pack the vans and go to the top where we normally go as well and go and explore for a bit hopefully go for a nice little walk up in the mountains so come join us and we'll see you at the top see you in a bit and I say again golden snow golden snow, <laughs> <Save your> snow. <laughs> yellow fleck We've got a snowman down, snowman down. <laughs> snowman down. <laughs> uh. So, we have parked up, and today, because the weather conditions are so glorious, as you can see, we are going to try and get up this gentle climb here onto the top of Ben McDewey, on top of the Cairngorms. So that's the Cairngorm Plateau at the top. So fucking hot here. Way down there in a the distance is the car park where we've left the vans. We've had to leave the dogs because the snow in certain parts is just too deep. We did try to bring Archie and Caesar, but they were both just like past their shoulders, should we say, struggling. So uh, Tina, Marco's uh, partner, is, is staying back there to do some work and she's got the two dogs. So we are probably about a third of the way up so far and it's absolutely glorious and we've got to go all the way to the top of there it's not bad is it they are staying in Hotel Tina yeah Hotel Tina, Hotel <laughs> yeah. Tina. Spade, right? <laughs> having their nails done yeah. <laughs> absolutely glorious look so yeah we got to there's some guys up in front of us uh, the conditions are not too bad um, it used to be a winter ML. We don't have uh, crampons or axes or anything like that. Uh, but what we are doing is just taking it nice and steady. And we'll go by um, the, our limits until we can get no further. But so far the conditions are still pretty cool. Very compact snow at the top. And obviously it's going to get a little bit softer. And probably as we go to the top, summits and all that sort of stuff. But absolutely gloomy. We'd, there was a uh, this was closed off yesterday and we couldn't get up the reason for that was we just found out was um, a mini avalanche had happened and apparently somebody was buried by an avalanche so all the emergency services police mountain rescue everybody was out um, thankfully they found the person from the information we've been told so again that's just a thing in our mind where we're like we will go to our limits and then turn around and go back but absolutely stunning And he's like, but you're all right? <coughs> Alice, good. Alice, good. Super.
Onwards. Onwards to the death zone. Let's okay. Go.